Will I be the a-hole for divorcing my wife after she thought I was lying about being roped as a child? I, 27 male, and my wife, 26 female, of have been married for two years and have been together for six. As context, I was repeatedly essayed by my brother's babysitter when I was around nine. She would remove my pants and then either stick my dong in her mouth or try and give me a hand job whenever my four-year-old brother slept. Most of the time I was paralyzed and wouldn't, couldn't do anything to stop it. She would always buy me sweets or video games for my D's as a reward. So in a weird way I started growing attached to her and would try and seek the abuse if it meant getting her rewards. I knew whatever she was doing was wrong but she would always threaten to take my life if I ever told my parents so I never did, while the abuse was actively happening. Everything stopped as soon as she graduated college and moved states. I only realized how messed up the things she did to me were when I was around 14, 15, and understood the concept of consent. When I tried to open up to my parents, strict Catholics, it never ended well. First they blamed it on corn, and claimed it corrupted my mind into imagining these things happening to me. If I claimed I was telling the truth, my dad would beat the shift out of me and my mom would ground me. I tried opening up to my friends, but their reactions weren't any better. My male friends just called me lucky and asked if the BJ was good. My female friends claimed I was just lying to get attention and laughed in my face. I learned to just try and forget the past, and vowed to myself that I would never mention this to anyone again. Now on to last week. Me and my wife had heard some good things about this show called Baby Reindeer on Netflix from our friends. Going into it, I knew it revolved around S.A. and stalking. In my mind I thought I was over the past and I could handle watching the show no problem. Big mistake. At the end of episode 4 I was literally on the verge of tears and I felt all the supposedly forgotten memories come flooding back. At the end of the next episode I couldn't hold it in anymore. My wife paused the show and just stared at me. After a while I did finally manage to calm down a bit. She asked me why I was crying and I just let everything out. She said she was sorry hugged me and we went to bed soon after. I apologized to her the following morning for ruining our night. From the moment I let her know about the abuse I felt something change in our relationship. No more kisses when I came back from work and no more initiating anything intimate from her side. She wasn't mean or anything but I felt like something was bothering her. I tried to apologize for maybe making her uncomfortable but she would just claim there was nothing bothering her and I was just being paranoid. Yesterday me and my wife got into a pretty heated argument about her lying about taking out the trash. But during the argument she said something that floored me beyond belief. She literally said, at least I'm not lying about being S.A.D. you narcissist. I literally couldn't process whatever just came out of her mouth. She tried apologizing right after saying that but I just packed a few clothes and left to stay at my friend's house. She tried calling me several times since but I haven't bothered picking up and have blocked her for time being. I know I might have trauma dumped on her and I know women aren't into that but I just want some sort of acknowledgement or support. I don't have anyone left to turn to with this and that's why I'm posting here. I've had two therapists to date and both didn't seem to help much. My gut is telling me to divorce her but she's genuinely the love of my life. Throwing away six years because of this one moment doesn't sit right with me but IDK. Will I be the a-hole for divorcing her? Am I actually the a-hole here?